In this video, we'll be learning how to install a Contrib module. Contrib modules are modules created by the Drupal community, and you will definitely be needing these in every Drupal project that you'll be creating. And similarly to the core modules, there are two ways of installing these um, Contrib modules. One, again, is through the administrative interface, or two, through the um, terminal using the Drush CLI. I will be enabling the admin toolbar module. So this um, contrib module, contrib is short for contributed by the way, this contrib module will make using the admin um, menu even easier. As you can see, there is a drop down. So rather than having to click on configuration and then load up a page, we can access particular links almost straight away. So most of the times um, these module pages will explain to you how to install the module in your um, your project so this is the command that would allow us to download the admin toolbar module to our local website in Drupal 9 and in Drupal 8 it is highly recommended you use composer to download your um, contrib modules so um, and as I said earlier most pages would actually have the instructions but sometimes they don't but it follows the generic um, format here which is composer require drupal slash then the name of the module and the name of the module would be what's in your address bar here so since they've gone ahead and actually typed the command for us i'm just going to copy that and then in my terminal i'm going to make sure i'm within my project directory which should be var www code post slash laptop which i am and i'm now going to run that command so paste it into your terminal and then hit enter So it will take a while but there we go so now that's installed we now can go back to our website and then just to make sure that it's actually there and it's been picked up by our um, Drupal system so if we type in admin we see that's the one there so if you click this you should see it matches with the machine name that we had within here admin toolbar but I want to stick with enabling modules through the terminal. I prefer this way. I think everybody should start getting used to using the terminal to enable or to run any Drush command. So I'm going to type Drush, EN, and then admin underscore toolbar, and then hit enter. Now let's clear caches just for good measure. So that's Drush CR. Now let's go back to our website and refresh this page. Now, if we hover above some links, we should see we are now able to get some drop down menus coming up. But you'll notice that we're not able to get into particular um, menu links here. And I've realized that with the admin toolbar menu, there is another module that we need to enable to get um, even better links. So that's this one, the admin toolbar extra tools. So again, I'm going to enable through the um, CLI. So I'm going to copy that to my clipboard, come back here and then again, type Drush EN and then paste the machine name of the module. Great. And again, for good measure, clear caches one more time. Now let's go back to our website and make sure that we are able to actually see deeper links. So let's refresh. And here we go. We can now see much more better links coming up. And that's it. That's how you enable a contrib module.